Hello YouTubers, welcome back. So tonight I'm going to be doing an unboxing video of my favourite um, box description, Box Excitement. Um, box Excitement, for those of you who don't know, is a description box full of um, crafty type items, um, jewellery, gift type things, um, stationery, that type of stuff. One of the um, really good things about Box Excitement is that um, Everything is made um, by the Box Excitement team rather than like a third party, so it's basically so it's not um, a subscription that is effectively just flogging third party stuff. And um, and what they provide is um, very unique, and I think is um, well worth the money. It's eighteen pound a month if you, you if you go for a regular uh, monthly subscription, but of course, um, as always with these. Um, um, Box descriptions, you can save some money if you book, you know, uh, three months or six months or twelve months subscription and you pay up front. So it comes in a letterbox friendly um, box, which is very good. So um, I just have it um, sent to my home address, and it always has this um, box excitement um, consignment um, um, tape on it. So I'm just going to open it up. I've been very good this month and haven't tried um, a, um, sort of sneaking online to see if anybody else to post this stuff up like I normally do. Um, so because I knew they were um, posting it yesterday, um, so I was quite quite tempted to see um, if anybody else had posted anything up. But I've been quite good this month. So it says. Um, so if you have a look here. They always have like the theme. On the, on, on the piece of card on the top lid and if you turn that card over it then tells you what's in the box but of course I'm not going to do that yet because I like this element of surprise um, they also have these cute little bits of confetti and I really 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 like the confetti type stuff that they have this month because it's leaves so um, I'm assuming it's going to be a very, very outdoory type um, theme this month and you can see there's like tissue paper um, um, surrounding what's in the box and uh, well on top of what's in the box and also and the box site with the sticker so I should stop waffling on and I should open the box and see what is inside wow so the first thing I will point out is this brilliant pen which is a um, pen that looks like a a, a, um, a stick. I really like that. That's very cool. Um, I don't know what colour the pen is. You see what I mean? So it's um, it's just a blue pen. But how neat is that? That's a really um, unique pen. Um, so as to say, they always have some kind of stationery type stuff in here, whether it be cards, notepads, that kind of stuff. So I should have a look to see what this is. This is a notepad, and um, it's just plain paper inside, um, and um, gorgeous little um, inner picture here of, um, I guess, flowers, flowers and things. Yeah, and on the back cover as well. Yeah, rose, isn't it? And um, other flowers another type of flower on the outside. Um, I'm one of these people who um, love um, notebooks. I've got an insane number of them. So notebooks are always going to be um, something um, I appreciate. So that's really cool. Um, what earth is this? This looks like, see some of the things, I'm never entirely sure what they are until I look at the um, thing afterwards you know the, the card I have absolutely no idea what, oh I think I know what this is is this for hanging up key rings and the like that one keeps falling out I'll have to watch that one um is this like sort of hanging up? yeah it's for hanging up key rings and stuff but it is not key rings keys I bet that's for hanging up keys oh I know what it is okay I got it now get there in the end these are key rings, aren't they? And you stick your keys on there, and then when you come home from work or college or something, you stick it in the, the little um, thing there. That's really cool. I like that. Brilliant. I bet I'm right about that. Um, I really like that. That's very cool. Very cleverly done, I thought. 
Um, and the next thing is a card. This is what I'm assuming this is. Um, cute little bird. Um, I've got quite a, an impressive card stash by now. And um, it's always um, good to have a card stash because you never know when you might need one. Yeah, so this is a nice card and it says happy birthday uh, happy birdie so that's really cute and I like that it's a nice little birthday card for someone who's into birds and whatnot and as they are unique to um, box excitement they're not like good from anyone else um, unless of course they also subscribe to box excitement so this is probably wrapping paper with a gift tag or a couple of gift tags which is pretty cool I'll just I'll just I'll take it out the wrapper just to see here we go yeah so I think this is wrapping paper uh, which I won't take out because I'll never get back in again and um, and there is a couple of um, gift tags we really like that one and I like that one too and um, I'll show you what the close up excuse the shiny bits because I don't want to take it out as a wrapper the actual uh, wrapping paper itself it's a really good one this one actually I think so far this box uh, oops a daisy there's this thing here wrapped up in a bit of tissue what earth is this? so Blooming lovely. Oh, how cute is that? This is, I'm guessing, a vase that you can put a flower in. And then I guess you hang it up. You hang it up on the wall or something. Yeah, it must be because of the, uh, what do you call it? The, um, the rope there. String. How cute is that? I really like that. That's a really nice little um, wall. You notice it's also got like a sort of a plastic leaf thing there. That's really cleverly done, isn't it? They have like a little crafty here thing as well. It says, make your own mini birdhouse. So there you go. Make your mini bird birdhouse there. And there's some padding at the back, which I guess helps with that. Um, yeah, so it's two bits of card. Oh, let's see that can open up properly. Okay, so you've got the instructions there, and some more instructions there. Um, yeah, that's really cool. So just a nice little um, crafty thing. Obviously, not to stick real birds in because it's going to be quite small and it's cardboard but um, yeah nice little ornaments to make up and the last thing in this box I always like using rating um, to open these until last the things in the little pouches so I'm guessing this comes some kind of jewellery but um, so quite often this let's have a look Ooh, what's this so this is it says your bracelet has been loosely knotted to allow you to find your perfect fit. Once you have tied it on, pull the knot tight and trim the excess and you can then use the toggle clasp it to, to put on and remove it. So there you go. Like a nice little um, cloth um, bracelet which um, I really like actually. Yeah, it's very cool. I've already got one of the um, box type bracelets on for from a couple of um, boxes of them. I tend to wear a lot. Cool, I really like that. So, now I've opened the contents of the box, I will have a read of what they said about it on the other side of this bit of card. So, there you go, this month's theme was Lost in the Woods. And then, when you have to turn it around the other side, it tells you basically what's inside the box. So it says, when you go down to the woods today, be sure of some lovely surprises. This month's theme has got a definite spring in its step, 
of exclusive mix of stationery, jewellery and homewares has been, have been inspired by the great outdoors. Everything from birds to honeycomb to fresh flowers. Take a deep breath and enjoy. Inside your box you will find a funky test tube vase to help bring the outdoors inside. And I really like that vase, I think that's quite unique. A, a wall mountable key holder. Yay! I'm always hopeless at trying to guess what these things are, it's quite embarrassing. Keep your keys handy for that long country walk, I think it's an excellent idea. A stylish birthday card with envelope. Some naturally stylish gift wrapping goodies, which are always useful. A cute trig pen, a great get creative in the great outdoors. A mini sketchbook for those impromptu outdoor art sessions and a stylish floral ribbon wrap bracelet for your next garden party. So there you go. And the um, box segments is very active on social media and um, if you have a look there you can see all the... Um, let me see if I can get it to focus. There you go. So as you can see it's on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, they have a blog and I, I was like, oh is that that pin thing or something? Pin interest, is that what it is? I don't know, pass. I don't use that one. Anyway, that's box excitement for you this month. That was a really fun month. I think that's probably been my favourite month for quite some time actually. Um, so um, I hope you um, enjoyed this video. Um, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe um, if you'd like to. Um, do you... Um, take out the subscription what do you think of this month um please um tell me in the comments below and um yeah i think that's about it um please um stay tuned for my next unboxing video which may be one of two it's either going to be liberty star vip which will be in about a week or so beginning of next month or i have just taken out um birch box um for a very short period um i'm trying it out because i've been a bit disappointed with um pink parcel i want to see if this one's any better anyway thank you very much for watching and um i will see you all soon in my very next unboxing video bye for now <laughs>